Hello again ladies and gentlemen, Tess Hi, Mighty Midget back again and welcome to Black Mesa. This is a game, ironically enough, I've wanted to play, I, I think I've said this nearly every video now. So I could be bullshitting, but I'm not. Generally, Black Mesa is a game, but I have been meaning to play ever since day one. Same with Portal Stories Mel. When those games first came out, I wanted to play them so desperately, but guess what? I didn't have a computer, did I? So I kinda couldn't, because as well as that, they're only on Steam, early access, blah de blah blah Basically, Black Mesa, if you don't already know somehow by now, if you don't already know what Black Mesa is, I don't know where you've been living. I'll quite frankly say the Stone Age. Black Mesa basically is a remaster to the original Half-Life, which I believe I'm actually playing at the moment, well, right now, come on. But I'm, I'm playing it kind of now, just kind of relive the memories, as well as like, what I wanted to originally do was play this and the original Half-Life kind of on the channel, but whether or not I will, I don't even know. But all that waffling aside, I'm actually just going to get straight ahead and get straight into the game. So I haven't played any of this at all. All the chapters are all completely there. The game still hasn't got Zen in it yet. However, that should be out by, I believe, the fourth quarter of this year. Okay, so straight away off the bat, this game looks rather good. Uh, again, considering the fact, as I said, at the same time, I'm playing Half-Life 1. Um, this is a bit of a surprise, actually, because it's Good all... Morning, oh, hi, welcome. how's it going? To the Black Mesa Transit System. Oh, yeah. This yeah, th this just looks absolutely stunning. The security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. Ooh, is it now? The time is 8.40. She lies, it's 11.30. Oh, hang on, I got stuck in the chat there. Temperature is 93 degrees. Oh, damn, that'd be hot outside. Oh, hi. 105. Fucking hell, that's hot. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Ooh, toasty. Healthy toasty. Wow, this game, though, seriously, going past it already is, uh... It's a bit good looking. I'm stuck in a friggin' pole again, for God's sake. You can just tell so much dedication has gone into this game because it's just. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Looking at like some of the signs and stuff here on the thing are just absolutely incredible. Has come to a complete halt all BMRF kind of logos. They're all here on their own. I all customised their own way. It's absolutely fantastic. So weird as well because again, I'm, I'm not massively far into Half-Life One on uh, on the original. Uh, or the original copy of Half-Life. I think I'm only chapter two in, chapter two or chapter three, something like that. But even like, so it wasn't too long ago when, since I went past all this. But just the difference is just mad because, of course, all the front, of, all the frame of the car and everything is all just kind of one. It's, it's all just there's no detail to it. Of course, I mean back in '97. In fact, it might even be older than that. Actually, Half-Life One, I believe it is. Um. But it's just, of course, there's only so much detail you could have got out of the computers back then. But now, you you got to see how much things have changed. Finally! That's right, we're only 10 minutes into recording. That's how long the bloody train journey is. 10 minutes. Didn't actually ever realise it took that long. Hi, buddy. Come and free me from the train. Solid. Another gun. Looks like you're running late. Uh, no. You must be Barney. Aw, man, you cut the pony. Yeah, it's funny. Sell out. I had a ponytail? Where have I been all along? That's, that's, that's my question. Rah, this is different. Hey, Sorry, I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, I'm sorry. I know, ago, I, I, in the original game, I know it's here. It's one of those days, I guess. I'm push button. Also having some problems push button. Test chambers too, but I think that's all straightened out. Can I, I want to push the button. To down there as soon as you've gotten your hat. Oh, to you guys are a bunch of boring old farts. I just want to push the freaking button. Get out of the way. Hey, it's happening. Uh, no, I didn't pull it. Good morning, Dr. Freeman. Oh, fuck off. Oh, no, it's this way, isn't it? Remember that from the original game? Uh, I hope it's this way. Jesus Christ, this is actually really different because, again, in the other Half-Life, it just seems to run on 90 degree angles. This is... This is actually a lot more... Oh, they're right there, Mr. Oh, piss off. I've got my hazard suit on. What are you saying? Right, bam. BAM! Move! I'm gonna slap you, silly. Don't you dare tell me what I can and can't do. I'm a strong, independent man. Authorised personnel. I am authorised personnel. Told you. 
wide and we all Back off. wear these ridiculous ties. Oh, you should see me, mate. I've got to wear a freaking house suit. Ah, <sighs> fine. There you go. I'll do it. Cool. Look at that. I've Jesus Christ. Makes me wonder what happened to the previous marks. Actually, hold it. I'm gonna go back. Move it, move it. I need me some heavy, heavy. Add some of this. Already? Oh, oh, really? I can only get 16% out of it? Alrighty then. Christ on a bicycle. Everything's all working now, isn't it? Right, hi. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, now because I'm in bright orange, that turns you on and gets me through the doors, doesn't it? In the barrel? Uh, to the elevator! Uh oh! Oh, that's not very good. Major fracture, it's just a tickle. And we're off again. Anyone got any first aid kits? I might have fallen out of the elevator. It was an accident, I swear. Ah, Gordon, there you are. Oh, it's Kleiner! You're right, dickhead. Another guy who forgot you or anything. Hey, Kleiner, have you been there yet? Oh, okay. Here, take a seat. Oh, okay then. Oh, no, my eyes aren't readable. Is very concerned. Your English is lacking. Analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Oh, uh, you know what, mate? Come on, Have a read a book. Humiliate me. Lighten up. I'm gonna file a complaint. Hang on, mate. What are you doing, Fred? It's been about the place. Have a cup. I'm gonna take this with me. I might, be th I might get thirsty. Shit! Oh! It's about to go critical. oh. <laughs> God, I thought I did that! <laughs> I was gonna say, this is a lethal bin. I'm gonna just fight off every head crab and zombie and everything with just a bin. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, How about a chip? I? Nothing you can't handle yourself. That's screaming failure to me. Don't know, don't know what points it out. Alright, fine, I'll go myself. That's cool. Actually, wait, can I just go down here? I can just go down here, that works. Oh, that's the second fracture I've had. Who needs legs? You gonna let me in? There you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Hombre button. I want to push the button. No time for cold feet, Chief. Step right up. Not cold feet, I wanna push the damn button! You've come all this way. Oh you know what, mate? Oh, you know what? That's I what I think. think you'd crack this soon. Suit or no suit. I sure hope you're playing on having computer. Kids. You know what, mate? You what, mate? Yeah. Hey, you're welcome, prick. Saying I shouldn't have kids. I'll make sure you don't have kids in a minute. If you don't shut the hell up, I'm gonna kick those balls so far up your mouth, you're gonna be tasting your own bollocks for the rest of your life. You're questioning your own bloody sexuality. Oh, well, I. Sample we've seen yet. You guys are a bunch of novices. Unstable. You're gonna throw me into a hazardous situation, huh? What kind of people are you? He's a highly trained professional. Debating. File a complaint. Oh, I don't know about that. We have complete confidence in you. Ah, uh, I'd, I'd, I'd question that one, you know. All right, let's go. Right, let's go this way. This is the way we want to go. Jesus Christ, you want to get that mic tested, man? Testing, 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 testing. One, two, one, two. Everything seems to be in order. It looks fine to me in here, although I don't know what I'm really looking out for. Let me oh, push my brake. Gordon, your right, suit should yeah. keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. Mm-hmm. Now, if you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors... I've already done that it. ...that way we can bring the anti-mask spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Well, let me bloody push the button then. Oh, it's gonna be shaky here, lads. I just wonder how far underground am I? With all this crap going on. Very good. We'll it wasn't hard, all I did was push a bloody button. Power to stage one emitters in three, two, one. Ah, Christ on a bicycle. That hurt. I'm seeing predictable phase arrays. What am I looking out for? Head grabs? Zombies? Stage two emitters activating now. Is that part of the test? Uh, Gordon, we cannot yeah. predict how long the system can operate at this level. Ah, oh, I thought you were saying let me throw a stool into it. This is exhilarating, uh, I'm having the time of my life. Small discrepancy in... Well, no. It's well within acceptable bounds again. 
Sustaining sequence. Nothing like giving me a bloody heart attack then, eh? Weird. Come on, let me have it, let me have it, let's push it in. Oh. Get away from the pier! Oh. Can't pull it out. Oh no! Save me! Raw, that's not good. Uh -oh, spaghetti -ers. Well, I'm in trouble. Oh no. Well how exciting, what a roller coaster that was. Oh god I'm back again. Hang on, how did I end up over here? Christ on a bicycle. Oh, hello Mr. Vortigrun. Hello. Aren't you beautiful? Turns out the G-Man's wise words were correct. Basically I fuck everything up. Wheat. Oh dear, that's not very good, is it? A little hamper now. I think it's supposed to use your eyes, not your hands. Running. Right, ah, uh, see, you see, you got what you deserved, didn't you, dickhead? This is everyone else's fault. This was never, this was never my idea. We need to get to the surface and let someone know that we're stranded down here. Lose your leg already. I want to see how that happens. What kind of danger is it? Ah, it's a creature. Look. Ah, oh, he's beautiful. So you're having a heart attack thing, I thought I'd never see a resident cascade where now suddenly you see some bloody ugly ass spider thing and you're like, oh, fascinating! You're a real scientist, aren't you? Oh god, I've spun the one in. Suit on until you end the clear. You hear me? Uh yeah, sure, sure thing. Whilst your bum chum over there goes and examines that head crab, you can let me out. Oh uh, Bloody Nora! Forgot about that. I'm just gonna chill in the corner. Don't mind me! You're gonna turn into splat. Oh no, so am I! Ow, 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 head, ow, bloody hell! Oh, I don't think you're doing very well, are you over there? You're just on fire with some ugly ass creature on your head. Is all this really necessary? What the hell happened to you? Already they playing through this, or what I played already, this game is just absolutely stunning. Oh, hang on a minute. Ah. Oh. Right, okay. Oh, that's a bit horrible, isn't it? Oh, hang on. Get out of the way, mate. Oh, bye, Felicia. Oh, I'm joining you, sir, apparently. My fate has been decided. I might have accidentally slipped. Whoopsie doodle. And bye bye. I've done it again, for God's sake. Jesus bloody hell. This game actually wants me dead already and I'm barely into the damn thing. Oh, all these crazy shenanigans. Gordon. How's it going? Man, am I glad to see you. Should I know you? Because you don't, your face doesn't ring any bells. Oh, piss off, mate. Hey, zombie, mate. Bloody hell! It's time to get lit! Two hours! Oh, running away, running away. And you. And you can have your flow back, mate. Hey, mate. Score one, score. Will you stop snatching my bloody flares off me? I need this. Cause you're an ugly bastard and I can't be dealing with things like you. Ooh, ooh, I should've just done that. Ah, I'm on fire. Ooh, let's go back this way, cause I know this is the uh... Oh, bad time. Shouldn't have walked in on you. Next time shut the door. Is this my locker? Someone's been in my locker. Bastards. Oh, really? Big shit, huh? Bloody hell, they're all after me. Why did I come back here to collect my belongings? Right, uh, you know what? Oh, bloody Nora. Oh, you know what? This is ridiculous. Ow. This is mildly painful. Pretty sure I should have a... Oi! You dropped something. Oh, you know what? You bloody head crabs. I haven't got time for you. I need to find me some sort of armament. And you, watch it, you. Oh, this way might look handy. Oh, crowbar. Even better. Oh, for God's sake. Have it. Right, now we're cooking with gas. You can get your head right in if you want. I wouldn't mind having a nose in my... There's nothing in there. What were you looking at? There's nothing in there. Oh, 
I'm not quite sure how to react to this, but um, I, I could say one of two things. Either this is how you react when your computer freezes, or when uh, when the hand drop game is just too strong. He's not having none of it. He's in the right. Okay, yeah, it's definitely number one then. He's definitely really pissed that Windows 98 is just crashed on him. Oh, this place is just wonderful, you know. Is someone gonna let me out now? Oh, okay, I got a, uh, oh. I still need some... Maybe not, maybe I don't need someone's eyebrows to let me through. Did I really say someone's eyebrows? Yes, because you're going to be scanned with someone's bloody eyebrows now, just to make sure they're on fleek so you can get into the premises. Yeah, that works, doesn't it? You're right over there, mate! You want a hand? There's a little somewhere you can crawl out of, maybe? No? Oh, I tried to help. I really did. This is actually incredible. This is generally almost like a whole new game. It's... I mean, I, I never really kind of properly read through in-depth reviews of this game, but everything I heard of this game, they just praised the absolute world out of it because of how incredible it was. And... I'm certainly not going to lie, but I'm playing through this now and this is just honestly absolutely insane on how good this is. Like, I, I can't properly put into words. I mean, I'm, I'm having such a blast playing through this already. Okay, I've just jumped into an elevator and it appeared that that was a bad idea. I have a feeling I should not have done this. It's... I, I really can't put into words of how absolutely incredible this game is. I'm I'm at a loss. This is this is almost like this is how Half-Life 3 should be. This kind of gameplay. Like where you're oh, I just Oh that's unfortunate. Hang on, let me help you. Let, okay, so I can pick up a massive wooden crate, but never mind, I wanted to help you, now I don't. On a more serious note though, seriously, this is just absolutely Fantas I, I generally don't have any other words to give this game apart from just a constant praise and wow. I am going to have so much fun playing through this game, I know of it. What the hell are you? Oh, you're a hound eye. Oh, ow, 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 all right, mate, all right. It's off. Dude. Minor laceration, I just got slapped by a zombie. Thank God. I haven't I seen you before? Listen, I know where you can find some more. Weaponry. Oh please! There's a security office not far from here. Huzzah! Take me with you, and I'll unlock the door. <sighs> All right. Fine. You're... Come on then. Take me with you, and I'll let you. I'll unlock it for you. Yeah. Although then again, I've just gone into some massively radioactive barrel. Well, that's. I'd, say, I'd like to say that's probably quite an important role, and then I can't seem to go anywhere in the facility. I feel like I'm being used. Oh, you know, it's not that bad. Trust me, you you get used to it. Pretty sure she just said that. Oh. Vsauce didn't make it far, did he? Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay, okay, you can't aim, can you, in these games? My bad. I forgot about that. Can I can I have some of these? No. Oh, well, right then. What's all these? Manual override. Oh, hang on, maybe these might be handy. Bit of puzzle to go a bit. Oh boy. So I'm assuming I've got to do something along these lines. Just disabled all of these. Don't know what I'm doing, but you know what? It might work. Oh, hang on, let's have a do with these. Hot water! Hot water, em like me, sir. Don't taste like it, water. Actually, I never went this way, did I? Ah, there you go. I'll explain it. That's what I've done. Okay, well, I'm going to leave this video of Black Mesa here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm, as I said throughout the video, maybe once or twice, the, this game... I am absolutely loving it. It's generally like playing a different kind of. Well, I, again, I understand that it is a different game on its own. Saying that, but comparing it, when you when you would think that there was an original game to this, that there is playable, and then there's this, like, you can compare the two side by side, and you definitely know it's a, a Half-Life game because you're running around with a crowbar and your guns, you're killing zombies and headcrabs and shit. But it's just absolutely fantastic. I generally can't put into words on how much I'm enjoying this game. So if you guys enjoy it. 
awesome, and I will definitely be playing a lot more of this, either in my free time or on this channel, that's for sure. But thank you guys ever so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then please go ahead and hit that like button. Again, as always, it means the absolute world to me. And if you enjoyed my content, then please go ahead and subscribe. But thank you guys ever so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys in the next video.